Hello my friends, welcome to Top Classical Music. Today we will present a short biography about Fanny Mendelssohn. Fanny Cassily Mendelssohn, 1805-1847, was a remarkable composer and pianist of the Romantic era, whose talent and creativity were overshadowed for much of her life by the fame of her younger brother, Felix Mendelssohn. Born into a wealthy and culturally influential family in Hamburg, Germany, Fanny displayed an early aptitude for music. Her parents recognized her talent and provided her with an extensive education in music, as was customary for young girls of her social class. Fanny's musical prowess was undeniable, and she quickly gained a reputation as a gifted pianist and composer within the family's elite social circles. She received valuable guidance and encouragement from her brother Felix, who also demonstrated remarkable musical talent. Together, they enjoyed a close and mutually supportive sibling relationship that fostered their musical development. Despite her considerable accomplishments, societal norms of the time prevented Fanny from pursuing a professional career as a composer. It was considered inappropriate for women of her class to seek public recognition in the arts. Instead, Fanny primarily composed music for private gatherings and the family salon. Her compositions, which include numerous piano pieces, leader, songs, chamber music, and choral works, reveal her exceptional talent and a deep emotional range. Her music often displayed a lyrical and introspective quality, characterized by graceful melodies and harmonic richness. Fanny's notable works include her piano trio in D minor, which is regarded as one of her finest compositions, and a collection of leader known as Garden Leader, Garden Songs. These pieces showcase her ability to evoke complex emotions and convey intimate, personal experiences through music. Tragically, Fanny Cassily Mendelssohn's life was cut short when she died of a stroke at the age of 41. In the years following her death, her music gradually gained recognition for its beauty and originality, and she is now considered an important figure in the history of classical music. Well, that's all for today. See you in the next video.